What's going on guys, my name is The Wolf Race and welcome to Random Flash Games. Now I found a couple of really good and also really bad Flash Games, I decided to play them for you guys today. Uh, so to start off with, the first one is Short and Sweet. I think it's supposed to be some kind of puzzle game, I'm not exactly sure, but let's go ahead and get into this and see what we can do here. I imagine it shouldn't be that, but whoa. Oh god, what is this? What is this guy? I'll bake you a cupcake so sweet with raspberry frosting so neat. When you take a bite, oh what a delight, to feel how it rots all your teeth. Ugh, dude. Like, why do you have to look like that? And why is he following my cursor as well? I just realized you guys, you guys can't see my cursor. Let me fix that real quick. Okay, you guys can see my cursor now. Just in case something actually happens that you guys need to see it. But, like, what? Why? Okay, whatever. I think we're supposed to take this into his mouth to rot his teeth. Because, yeah, look at those teeth. Ooh, okay, yeah. Kids, that's why you brush your teeth. Ooh, uh, won't you pass me that sweet tooth? Uh, we're sp oh, okay. Let's just take that out. Uh, yeah, you can take that. I don't want it anymore. What the... I, I didn't know this game was going to be like this at all. I mean, I like it. I like the style of it for sure, but it's just, I, I wasn't expecting weirdness. So yeah, I mean, it's a nice little surprise, I suppose. I'll bake you a pie oh so nice with apple and cinnamon spice. Now don't you fret or start to regret when you must have just one more slice. All right, so I imagine the sled you just wants a slice of pie. Hey, oh, okay. What that mouth do? That mouth do some weird things. I don't like that. What is this thing over here in the corner? I don't. I don't know what that is, but I kind of want to click it, but at the same time, I, I think I'll test that later. Okay, eat, eat the pie. Oh, you can actually take out either piece that you want, and it actually looks like, you know, the certain piece that you took out. You know, it's a nice little detail there. Okay, take the pie, lady. How do you, do you like that? Oh, oh, I think she needs to eat more than one. Oh, yeah, you, can, you guys can see she's getting a little bit more chubby now. That's fine, you know, none, none's wrong with a thick woman. Oh, okay, yep, except when she's that thick, and her eyes start doing that thing. All right, um, I, I'm known for having a big heart. Yeah, that's that's a big hurt. Does anyone want to take this, uh, Mr. Butler, dude? Whoop, whoop, why is your hand freaking out, uh, Butler, dude? Okay, yeah, take the heart. I don't want it anymore. I I'm scared. I just want to go home, man. Okay, what's this guy doing here? Again, he looks at my mouse cursor. That's fine. Perhaps this is more to your taste. A cookie with pineapple paste. Wait, pineapple paste? I've never heard of that before, but that's fine. Uh, but you must take care. None drops in your hair, for that would be such a cruel waste. That would be a waste, man. Don't waste food. Oh, he doesn't want it. I'm gonna drop it on your hair then, I don't care. Yeah, that, that's what you get, dude. Holy crap. Okay, I guess it was like acidic, uh, paste? I, I don't, I don't even know. I'm not gonna try to understand this anymore. Uh, now you are ribbing me. Okay, I imagine we take one of his ribs. Hello, Mr. Butler. Take a rib. I know that's what you want. Alright, this lady over here, she's, she's having a good time. At least she's the most normal looking one so far, except unless you do this and make her go cross-eyed. Of course, that looks funny. Uh, and if you find all that too plain, try ice cream with cro with chopped candy cane. Sorry, I can't speak. Uh, by the look in your eyes, you may be surprised by what it will do to your brain. Oh, is it going to cause some kind of frostbite? Oh, whoa. Oh, God. Why did they have to do these things? Like, is that is that a necessary thing to do right there? I, I, don't, I don't think so, but take the ice cream, lady. Yep. Uh, she's... Oh, she's not... She's not enjoying that. Yep, okay. Brain freeze. Pretty good. Here's some food for the thought. Um, I bet we just... Oh, oh. Okay. Yeah, someone take the brain, Mr. Butler, please. Where, where's your hand? Okay, it seems like you have to be, like, pretty low to be able to drop it in. Okay, this is... Is this almost over, please? I hope this is the last guy. Beware of the strangers you meet, especially those with a treat. If you don't know their names, don't play their sick games. Or you, or they may cut your life. Oh. Short and sweet. Yeah, um... Is this maybe supposed to be a game about, like, not taking candy from strangers? Which is definitely a really good, like, thing to know. Like, kids don't ever take candy from strangers, but did it have to be in this style? I don't think so. And for our next game, we have Old American Bikini Jump. Now, I hope I don't get, you know, demonetized for this, but I'm not really too worried about it because this... I mean, just look at that lady right there. I mean, that is just... That's hot. I don't even know. I just happened to see the picture of, like, the lady with her bikini there and her eyes, and I just, I, I had to check it out. So, apparently this is some kind of platformer game. Oh, crap. Sorry, I just moved the page there. Don't worry about that. Okay, we can move back and forth with the lady here. She has a fidget spinner. I just, yeah, I don't know. Let's just get into, oh, oh, I already died. Okay, so, look, so, oh, oh, whoa, okay. We're caught on the edge. We're good. Now we just have to go over here. Now, I don't know if this game has any kind of, like, story or anything to it. It looks really bad, and that, that's why I wanted to check it out. Plus, because, you know, the lady with the bikini and fidget spinner, of course, we had to check that out, too. So, we're just going to keep going here. It says something about you win, baby. Oh, was that really... That was... That was it? I mean, like... Okay, well... That's fine. And for our next game, we have Famous Movies Parodies. Now, I don't really know that much about movies. I really don't watch them that often, but the thumbnail looked pretty funny, so I think it's going to be like a funny game. So yeah, it should be a good time either way, even if we don't understand what's going on here. Plus, you guys might understand, and yeah, I'll just look stupid. Either way, it's going to be a fun time. Okay, let's go ahead and just wait for this to load up here. 
nice little English for me because I can't speak anything else. I'm, I'm not that smart. So do we click on the little tickets at the bottom maybe? I'll click on the red. Uh, no, okay, you can't click on those. Maybe on the numbers on the side. Let's click one. Let's see what happens here. Or maybe we'll click the play button. Okay, yeah, just the play button. Okay, cool. Famous movie parodies. Test your knowledge about popular movies of all time. Can you recognize the movies behind the parody? Look closely at the drawings. Uh, one, two, three. Or ABC, I mean. Uh, select the right answer between three options. Okay, can do. Uh, I'll try anyway. Act one. Who's it going to be first? I did see something. Yeah, okay. Pulp Fiction. I know this one. That was the one that I actually did know from the thumbnail. Okay, let's go and just select Pulp Fiction. Yep, I got a nice little medal for that. that this, this is pretty easy. Looks like there's one out of 40. Holy crap, there are a lot of uh, movie parodies here. Okay, beautiful. Uh, this is Ghost Ass Shell, obviously. If you guys haven't seen that movie, I definitely recommend it. Of course, it's actually Ghostbusters. Let's go and do that there. Do we get a medal every single time? Like, that, that feels good, but at the same time, it feels like I'm not worth it. Oh, I don't know what this one is, but uh, the mask, I don't think that's right. Scream, I don't think that's right either. V for Vendetta, I've never watched that before. Did I get that right? I'm not sure. This one is the Titanic, of course. There we go. Yeah, I think I got that last one right because you only get a medal if you get it right, I think. I'm not sure. It's a little bit confusing. This is the Silence of the Lambs. I do, there no, I do know that much. Sorry, again, I can't speak. It's just, yeah, it's literally 8.40 in the morning. I don't know why I record this early. It's just, I don't know. I, I get so am amped up to get on and record that I just I just do it any time I want to. Okay, Alien vs. Predator. I'm pretty sure that's what that is. Yep, beautiful. And the next one. I wish it would go just a little bit quicker, though, because I don't, I don't have much patience. This one, I'm not too sure. It doesn't seem like 12 Monkeys or 2001 A Space Odyssey. Uh, there's a bunch of, like, little black cubes around here, around, like, a monkey plank. I don't really know, but Planet of the Amps is what I'm going to say, which it wasn't, so... Yeah, that sucks. Another one I'm not too sure about. This could be The Ring, maybe, because I know, like, they have the scene with the movie, or, I mean, with the TV, and, like, the thing comes out and stuff. Uh, but it could also be Poltergeist. I've heard a lot about that movie, but not too much. Um... The Conjuring? I'm not sure. Let's just do Poltergeist. Oh, uh, I guess it was Poltergeist. Okay, cool. This one here, I'm pretty sure is the, the Addams Family. That's, yeah, okay. You see, I know some of these movies, like some of the like most popular ones that everyone knows. I do know those. Um, but yeah, for the most part, I'm not I'm not too smart. I think this is Psycho because of like the one scene where you, you know, crashes through the door. And, Here's Johnny and that whole thing. Uh, so yeah, let's go do Psycho there. Yep, that's correct. Beautiful. So I'm actually not doing that bad. I'm doing a little bit better than I thought I would. Oh, bonus. Oh, pick the TV show. Um, what do you mean? Like, pick whatever TV show I want? I... Wait. I don't, I don't know. Oh, I think they're meaning to pick the TV show that is actually, like, a real TV show, maybe? I... I, I don't know for sure. If not, then... Or, I mean, if that is the case, I'm gonna get this wrong, but I'm gonna pick the taco because he's a freaking taco. Okay, I guess that was incorrect. Thank you, game. I, I, I appreciate it. That one's pretty easy. That's the Matrix. No big deal. I, I, I don't know how long I'm going to play this game, but it's actually, it's not that bad. It seems pretty funny. You know, like the pictures are funny. I'm, I'm having a good time. So I'm just, I'm just going to keep playing. Okay. So yeah, King Kong, I'm pretty sure. Yep. Except that it's a little bit reversed with the lady holding the gorilla there. Pretty sure it's not how it happened, but whatever. Uh, Tron, Zoolander, Mighty Morphin Power Rangers. I think that's Power Rangers, right? Because of the suit. Uh, could also be Zoolander though, because of the beard and the way this guy looks. But I'm pretty sure it's the Power Rangers. Yep, okay, beautiful. This one, of course, is the Exorcist. There's a whole bunch of uh, demonic stuff going on, as as things do. This here, oh, okay, that's a little bit racy. I almost had to censor that. Okay, this is uh, American Beauty, American Hor History X, American Pie. Uh, American Pie? I, I, don't, I don't know. It seems like... I, I don't know what it seems like. It just seems like a bunch of red cats and a, and a lady that isn't dressed. Uh, American Pie. That, that's usually what happens in those movies, so that's all I can imagine there. This is E.T. That one's easy. Got a little bit of Rambo going on there. Yeah, these are actually, they're they're getting a little bit easy, though, so yeah, that that's where the fun kind of ends. Let's go choose Jaws, because I know that one's there, too. Uh, but yeah, let's go ahead and move on to our last game. And for our last game today, we have Harry Potter LOL, and that's literally the name of the game, as you guys saw there. Okay, this is, uh, I, I, don't, I don't know what this is going to be about, but I imagine it's going to be pretty bad. Drag the pixels of the picture and animate. Oh, oh. Oh, that's, that's what it's supposed to be about. Okay, let's just go ahead and fix up his eyes there. Okay, so it's gonna be like kind of a little silly picture editing game, if that's even a game. I'm not even sure, but I just have to play for a few minutes here to end up the video. You guys know how it is. Lingardium Leviosa. It's Lingardium Leviosa, not Lingardium Leviosa. What you said to me? I mean, it's not much of a game, but I mean, it's pretty funny. I mean, you can stretch your faces around, you can make little scenarios of what they would say, like, Potter, you, you must turn over the... Wait, what, what is Harry Potter even about? I don't I don't even know. Something about, like, the, the scar on his head, and his, his parents were dead and stuff like that. Um, but yeah, other than that, I don't really know. So, Harry, get, give me the give me the ring, Harry. 
this isn't even the right series, Voldemort. What are you doing? Have you seen my eyes lately? I'm I'm clearly having trouble. It's actually a way to animate it. What does that do? Oh, okay. Well, that's that's kind of lame, but whatever. You're a wazard, Harry. I'm a what? A wazard, Harry. I don't even know what I'm doing anymore. I'm just, I, yeah. I, I have no idea. I'm just, I'm, I'm having a good time, though. Uh, but yeah, this is a pretty fun game. I mean, if you can call it a game, there's a little bit of Dolby for you guys, because I know you guys love him. Look at him. And he's just, he's just doing his thing. But yeah, I think that will be it for today's video. I hope you guys did enjoy it. If you did, make sure to leave a like down below and subscribe to join the pack, because we're pretty dang cool around here, if you guys ask me. And I didn't even mean for this to be a random Flash Games video, so I do apologize for that. Like, I came on just to film one, but it ended up not being long enough, and you guys know how it is. So yeah, I apologize if there wasn't really that much structure to this video, or if the game's kind of sucked which they did but I, I still had a good time I, I felt like it was a pretty good video of course other than that thank you guys so much for watching and liking i hope you have a great day and i will see you guys in the next one take care and stay awesome guys